So the World Wildlife uh, Fund Canada just did a, a real first uh, studying wildlife populations in Canada from uh, 1970s to 2014, the most recent data. And what the data shows is quite alarming. It shows that of the vertebrate species studied, uh, about half are in decline. And of that half, the average decline is 83%. And what that tells us is if a species is in trouble, it's in serious trouble. And there are rapidly diminishing populations of that species. And it's a really significant number, uh, over 900 species. Why? Um, well, the why is, is complicated but clear. Um, it's because of habitat loss, uh, you know, things like increasing urbanization, for example, paving over uh, areas and industrial activity in more remote areas. Uh, it's because of pollution, invasive species, sometimes over exploitation of resources, and of course climate change, which affects everything else and is causing wildlife populations to move and the other impacts like pollution to become much more severe. What can people do, like right now, to help? People can do a lot right now. For example, if you live in an urban area, something simple is planting native habitat in your garden. That's really important to help species. Um, you can be citizen scientists. You know, one of the reasons that waterfowl came back across North America was a coordinated strategy based on what bird watchers were recording. And that weren't, wasn't government science, that was just citizens going out and recording information. We need help like that today in fresh water, for example, because there's simply not enough information across the country about the health of our fresh water. And you can join a local conservation organization. There's amazing things happening across this country to restore habitat and to start to create a reversal of the decline of wildlife, but people need volunteers. Uh, and there's an awful lot can be done with the power of volunteers. Of course, we also need industry to act and government, but I think it starts with people. And we know from our work at WWF Canada, when people get engaged, we can make tremendous things happen together. And WWF is going to start their own kind of plan? Yes, we, we're uh, calling a summit for next spring in Toronto, uh, likely in May. Uh, and what we're going to try and do at, at that summit, there'll be citizens, scientists, uh, businesses, industry, local governments, provincial governments, federal governments, we're tr going to try and help create a strategy to reverse the decline of wildlife in Canada. It's really urgent and uh, we've seen that the past measures haven't worked. That's why wildlife populations are still declining. So we, we need a clear plan, one that everybody can buy into and one that will actually reverse the decline, not just manage it, but reverse it.